pretty good to see you again. Hi, hi, nice Time you. flies. A year. A year. Yeah. How have yeah. you been? Okay, thank you. Busy? Yeah, Busy? Busy, mm. yeah. Well, I can tell this is a pretty much a contemporary concept. Yeah, uh, yeah. I mean, we, we would... We were calling it really as sort of a metropolitan, metropolitan. contemporary, mm -hmm. more of a nighttime audience. Really. Nighttime? Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. And so slightly darker colors, mm -hmm. more dramatic contrast of mm -hmm. uh, materials and fabric. Is it uh, what uh, you have been briefed or this is purely like? Um, it was partly, it was discussion mm -hmm. with the client and obviously we have done one show unit here mm -hmm. before, which was a very different concept. So we obviously wanted to do mm -hmm. something which was a contrast to that. So we decided to make it more of an urban feel. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Well, this apartment sure is pretty luxury, mm -hmm. especially in terms of space. Yes, now, I yeah. need you to take me <laughs> to have a right, look because okay. I will get lost <laughs> so big. <laughs> Entering the master bedroom, get yourself ready because it's huge. It's almost a, a unit. Yeah, it's, it's, unit. it's like a large, uh, like a large studio. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. <laughs> um, so, well, in here, obviously, the bed we put in the key position, which is adjacent to the um, balcony. So you have sliding doors which go onto the balcony uh -huh. and the pool. Um, we have the walk-in dressing room here which is um, obviously fully fitted out, waiting for all the clothing to arrive. Mm -hmm. And a small um, dressing area on this side, which is mirrored. Um, so we wanted, we wanted this obviously to follow on in terms of concept, mm -hmm. but be slightly more glamorous in terms of the mirrored finishes, the mirror ball light fitting, which obviously is over the bedside cabinet. And then this is the large um, window elevation. So just a very small seating area um, opposite the bed. If you did want AV provision, that would go here, mm -hmm. um, the console table. But again, we haven't provided that mm -hmm. as part enjoy of our Enjoy the piece. Yeah, yeah I think it is yeah. more of a sanctuary. You have a pool outside, and a the nice pool area. Outside, yeah. 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 What floor did it Yeah, right, right. And the surprise is actually here. There is a room inside this room. This is what I meant by another room, <laughs> but it's a toilet, it's a bathroom. <laughs> yeah, um, this is the master bathroom, which is very large. Mm -hmm. So you have uh, two entryways coming into the room. Everything is actually very symmetrical mm -hmm. in terms of the vanity counter with the two basins, um, the freestanding bath, which is in the window bay, the bay window, and WC enclosure. And then behind here are, is a large, um, Double shower. Double shower, so which means the his and hers, his and hers yeah. continue even to the shower area. Yeah, yeah. Did a pretty more, a small unit, but this time is um is a is a huge yeah, uh, it's yeah. a huge unit. Which one do you prefer? Um, I think both both have um, advantages. Mm -hmm. I mean, the small unit is very fun to do. Mm -hmm. The larger one obviously gives you more opportunity to uh -huh. you know to to play on your design concept. One of the problems, though, actually, with the larger unit is it does it really does suck up the furniture and the artifacts. Mm -hmm. you know, because it's a large space and you know you have to be very careful to, to obviously not over furnish mm -hmm. but definitely not under furnish. Right? Yes, this is exactly what I would like to ask you um, if not to talk about this unit, right. if um, a lot of um, consumers, mm -hmm. uh, especially for first-time buyers, mm -hmm. maybe they uh, won't be able to afford you know, right. expensive right. interior design fees and all that. Um, three don'ts, you know, mm -hmm. three things that they must not do to a unit. Um, uh, don't rush. Don't rush. Yeah. Don't um, don't make false economies. Mm -hmm. And uh, don't follow fashion. What is current at that time too slavishly, mm -hmm. because within a year you'll be fed up with it. Mm -hmm. So I think you really need to, you know, obviously one's very enthusiastic when you are starting, but just be very, very careful. And especially a lot of friends giving you a lot of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you advice. should put this. Yeah. I think you should yeah. put that. Yeah. So don't listen. Don't listen, listen to the professionals. Yeah.
Yeah. Follow, follow your, your you know, true requirements. <laughs>